This frame has a few decals on it, and they are material matched to the frame's plain parameter-based PBR material. For details on material matching, check out the documentation. If we take a look at the shader editor, we can see that the frame's material actually has an image texture connected to the principled BSDF shader node. The UVs that I'm using here are super lazy, it's just a side view projection, but it will do for this demonstration. Any nodes connected to the principled BSDF shader will be ignored when material matching decal materials. Consequentially, the decals will stand out on textured materials like this. Decal Machine 2.4 introduces the Transfer UVs tool in the Tools section of the 3D View sidebar. The result of calling it is a texture matched decal. If the decal isn't projected or a panel decal, you can move it around too, and the UV transfer will update accordingly. The Transfer UVs tool does three things. First, it creates a second UV channel on the decal. Second, it set up the normal transfer mod to also transfer UVs. And finally, it updates the decal material using the image textures from the decal's parent material. Now, this decal shares a material with the previous one but it wasn't selected when the transfer tool was called earlier. In the shader editor you can see that the UV channel is missing. So just run transfer UVs again with the decal selected. What you can also see is that the transferred texture seems to swim on top of the decal. This is expected, because it's not affected by the decal's parallax. The tool does have the option to use parallax too, as well as normals. However this will only work in cases where the UV spaces of decal and parent are oriented in the same way, which unfortunately most of the time won't be the case. And so once I rotate the decal or its UVs, the parallax effect falls apart for the transferred texture. Still, this is a great tool, and the lack of parallax shouldn't really be noticeable in real-world scenarios, because remember, decals are details. If you want to reverse a UV transfer, you can simply call the tool with the Alt key pressed, and everything will be restored. 